That's what I'm talking about. Wait. Okay, now, from the beginning. Hey everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I know that I've been a little bit silent over the last like week, I think. But yeah, you know, life gets a bit dear makar. So yeah, I had to take a little bit of a step back and just figure things out. But I am back and I'm back with a try on haul video. If you are new to the channel, please do subscribe. And if you're a diehard, welcome back. Um, so this video has actually been requested before funny enough because um, I always shop for things and I always shop online so here's the things that I'm going to try on um, one of them is from a local brand which is new which is called Bodycon SA um, and I bought a body glove I've been looking for it I know it's spring now but like you know um, traveling there are those days where it's a bit cooler than others so yeah either way I have a body glove um, and this yeah so it's this one I obviously had, had opened it so the boxes are open because I had to check that my orders are inside um, the second one is from Zara I bought denims um, and I bought shoes Ugh. and I bought um, this other like one piece shorts vibe also like a jumpsuit really cute it's white and then the other one is from house of cb um if you know me you know i'm obsessed with that shop so yeah i purchased some purchased some items from there and um, i'm super excited to try it on with you guys because i've never done a, like a try on haul before um and also just to give you guys like a bit of an inside scoop of online shopping and um yeah, more or less just give you how long things took to get here, um, what I had to pay for certain items, the custom fee on House of CB because that's a UK brand. So yeah, I'll just quickly break that down before I start trying on the items, which is why I'm standing because I don't want to sit in this stand and sit in this stand and sit in this stand. So yeah, first things first, body can I say, quick, quick, I think... I ordered it and I think within a week, just over a week, it arrived. Um, it is an independent local girl by the name of Osile and um, yeah, I really enjoyed the fact that um, she gave a lot of updates with her emails like every other day or so you get an email saying okay, your parcel is now moved from um, order to being made, yeah because they, they, they make it as you order. So it's like she emailed and says okay. Um, your order's being made now. Okay, it's moved from made to packaging. Okay, from packaging, it's off now to shipping. From shipping, it's on the way. And then it's like, it's here. So I really, really love that. Attention to detail. Um, it made me feel very comfortable that my order is going to arrive. And yeah, that's just very important. So I really like that about her. Um, with regards to the packaging, I already opened it, but I really like the fact that it came like with a nice pink bow. I think the bow's inside, but anyway, yeah, we can whatever. Um, yeah, here's the bow, and it came wrapped in pink tissue paper with a cute little message, and then it has some nice hand wipes in the box. And yeah, um, overall, I was really, really happy with the packaging of this product. Um, and yeah, the quality is also really, really nice, as, as I'm feeling here. So when I try that on, I will give more feedback. But in terms of delivery, 10 out of 10. Love that. Um, and communication, very important. Okay, let's move on to... Yeah, I rolled my eyes there for a second because we all know that our good girl over here um, with online is a bit tedious. Um, not even a bit, it is quite tedious because I'm, I'm not, I don't understand why they take so long to deliver your items. Um, yeah, it's a bit frustrating um, and then there's like breaks in between of silence and you don't know like when is my parcel going to arrive and whatever. So yeah. Um, as I'm pretty sure most of you guys have ordered from Zara online and we can all relate that they are not the best with online especially during this lockdown like it just went from bad to worse but I mean they arrived in one condition um, I like the packaging as we all know um, 
Yeah, it's just normal standard packaging and with the tissue paper inside. And these are the shoes, the jeans, and the one piece. And um, they arrived yesterday. I ordered it two weeks ago. Yeah. Blech. Blech. But anyway, it arrived. It arrived in one piece. Um, but in terms of delivery, I give them a 5 out of 10, like, do better Zara, you're such a global recognized brand and your delivery is, yeah, yay. But anyway, it arrived. Um, and now for the last one, House of CB. Love the shop, been using them since 2017, I've never had issues. From the first time I bought from them, um, I discovered this shop through an old friend at the time. And um, yeah, I've just always loved their dresses, especially like for events. Like I, I love wearing their dresses to polos because like they've got really nice silhouette dresses which go over the knee also. Nice and light, nice and fun, um, true to size. Um, the only thing that irks me about them is the damn customs, jeez. Yo. So like for customs for this I paid 1,000 Rand um, Yeah, dude, it's a, bit, it's a bit hectic Before it used to be like 300 Like when I first started, like 300, 200 Rand and like, you know, whatever But what I do appreciate about House of CB is their very, very quick delivery um, Can come between any time between 4 to, let's say 7 business days um, and it's delivered right to your door. UPS will give you a call and then let you know about how much you owe for custom fees and 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 um, And as you can see the packaging is really really cute You can choose if you want sustainability or gift wrapping one. I always go for gift wrapping because I'm not going to spend that much amount of money and not get a cute little box You know and I keep my boxes for some of my dresses. So as you can see it's just a nice little stretchy ribbon and Voila, got your packaging inside and they oh, it always comes with your receipt in a little thing like this. And it tells you like, thank you for your pur purchase and whatever, and obviously the tissue wrap. And yeah, love them. And yes, true to size. So guys, now that I've explained all of that, we now get into the fun part of trying on what I bought. But anyway, I'm still gonna look cute now. Cute on a budget. <laughs> so let's go! So, got the first one on. And this is the body glove from Bodycon. As you guys can see, it fits really, really well. Snug on the ass. <laughs> and um, it sucks everything in. Like, you know? I don't know. I really like it. Sorry, my mirror's over there. So, if I. I'm out of eyes then you must know so I really like it because it's got very the quality is amazeballs like it's really really great um, and it's got a place you can put your fingers in which is closer you know <laughs> and yeah it's really like on your body I feel like Beyonce in like single legs you know and it's nice to get in because the zip is at the back. I just didn't zip it all the way up because like, geez, I'm out of breath. But I like that, like, it's like, yeah, flexible. So it's really cute. Oops. It's really nice, very comfortable, um, very affordable. I think I paid like 600 Rand for it, if I'm not mistaken. Um, I think that included delivery. I'm not, I can't remember cannot remember but yeah this is the body glove and i think it comes in white too but i want all oh, white or gray but i wanted black because black goes with everything but yeah fits really well it's not uncomfortable by the cooker um <laughs> and yeah i just think when i go to the bathroom it's going to be irritating i think you can even wear it like to the front with the zip so here's the zip and yeah it's nice Affordable, comfortable, and great quality. So I definitely advise it, especially for traveling, and if you just wanna, I don't know, <laughs> wear it. <laughs> but yeah, cool. 
we're going to try on the Zara stuff next. So, um, the top is mine that I've always had, but it's also from Zara, but from ages ago. And these are the denims that I bought. Um, they were $6.99, and these are like the paper bag, paper bag fit, the new style. It's not really a new style, but you know what I mean. That's really popular. And as you can see, Zara's sizes are very tricky when it comes to jeans. I'm a girl with a kadonk kadonk, um, and I need a size that fits. And I have paper bag jeans from them in the same size, but this one is slightly tighter than the other one. Um, I think if you've seen my Instagram IGTV video of the spring looks, you will know which jeans I'm talking about. So I bought the same one, but these are a little bit tighter. I'm guessing the, the make is a bit different because these ain't baggy but I'm not gonna lie and say I don't like them I like how they fit um, this is a size 42 um, I like how they fit though I'm not, I'm not mad at it I'm not mad at it you know you see I'm not mad at it I like it it's like if we looked at the back <laughs> so yeah they're comfortable though they're just not as baggy as the other ones because i love how baggy those ones are not baggy but loose um these are more on more body fitting than the other ones but love their jeans but they're just very tricky with sizes so my advice with jeans when it comes to zari rather go in store and don't buy it online because touch and go I have three pairs of jeans from Zara. The other one is a skinny low rise and I bought that online too and it was quite tight when it arrived but because I just had a little bit of weight, they fit now but yeah, that's, a, that's not how it's supposed to be. It was kind of the size. Anyway, so these are $6.99. Love them, especially for summer. Uh, love them. Very snug fit. As long as I can drop it low. <laughs> then I'm okay, but yeah, they fit, they're great. I love the high waisted knit, especially for the food food. Um, very important, ladies, for me, for me, that I wear high waist just to keep the food food safe. But yeah, love it, really cute. Just would wear a belt just to accentuate the waist. Um, but overall, really cute. While we're here, um, while we are here, out um, the shoes that I purchased um, are these really cute um, sandal heels and I've been seeing them a lot um, I know you guys know this shoe I've been seeing them a lot so I'm gonna try these on um, with this jeans and then you can just see how cute they look um, and then I'll also keep them on for the jumpsuit that I bought from Zara these shoes are cute though. They are cute. I hope you guys can see them. They're very cute. Um, yeah, I've been wanting shoes like this for a very long time. And I've got them. So they costed $8.99. Ridiculous. For a sandal heel. But I think they are super cute. Um, the one is a bit tighter than the other because my one foot is bigger than the other. But um, it will stretch out um, as time goes really cute comfortable and yeah you I can wear with anything you know especially summertime you can wear with literally anything dress jeans shorts whatever but I've actually just decided I'm not gonna wear them when I put on that that uh, that romper thing just because like yeah they are a bit tight on the one foot and it's sore and yeah but yeah really cute as you can see um, <laughs> um really cute so yeah i will i definitely recommend them especially for someone who doesn't want to wear heels because heels can get really tiring so um they're nice man cute squinkies they're nice they're cute so yeah definitely would i definitely do not think that they're worth 900 rand, 899 is 900 rand. I do not, do not think that they're worth it. But 
I think they're cute. I think if you can get a more affordable pair of these strappy sandal heels, definitely do the things that needs to be done. But eight ninety nine is a bit steep, Zara. Y'all, y'all were tripping when you guys when you guys priced it. But yeah. On to the next one. This is the shorts. The I don't know what it's called. Short jumpsuit from Zara, and I love it. I love it. Okay. I just love how it fits. I love that it's comfortable. It's denim fabric um, and this costed $6.99 um, and I just really love it. it's comfortable especially on the waist area the shorts there's space to move as you can see it's there's space under my thighs under my butt so it won't like it doesn't sit on my you know um, so there's space to breathe um, it's comfortable it doesn't roll up it doesn't seem to roll up you know when you like wearing shorts and they roll up especially for someone with I've got thick thighs and I've got a booty so I like it it's really it's really nice I've always wanted something like this like I've always so when I found this at Zara I was like this is it it's it this is what I wanted I actually wanted a long version but then I was like nah let me get a short version especially for summer and spring and it's a nice one piece because it's like you know top and shorts done um, I wouldn't, I think it's very weird to wear belts with one piece, even though the loops are there. I would not do that. Um, but I just like that I could wear it with sneakers, I could wear it with heels, I could wear it with slides. Um, I could either dress it up with, and make it cute for a night out, I could dress it down and go to lunch. Um, so it's a very versatile fit, you know, and it's got space to move, which is important. Because if I wear it when I go out, I want to move. So, yeah, it's got nice space. Um, everything is, it's, yeah, it's perfect size. I bought a, a large. Yeah. Bought a large um, and it's perfect. I would not have, if I went with a medium, I think it was going to be a bit too tight around my thighs. Um, but it still would have fit. But I prefer comfort over anything. So yeah, I like it. Especially like if I had to go to a safari, how cute would I look? This tea hat, a straw hat, this tea straw bag, you know? Karuchik, done, bam. So yeah, love it. Love the pockets, love the fit. Oh, ooh, okay, didn't see that. It's got like, you can close your pockets, clip it and clip it and yeah. As I said, $6.99. Um, I'm not sure if they still have any left, but I know there was a lot of long, long, long pants version of it. So yeah. But anyway, this is. I think this was my. This is one of my favorite buys. Other things that I bought. I might even wear it today because I'm meeting a friend for lunch. So hmm. Hmm. Yeah. Cute. That is all the Zara items. Um, I'm now going to move on to the House of CV items. Um, I bought a top and a dress. Um, I'll wear the top with the jeans from Zara um, and then I'll wear the dress and then it's a wrap y'all. I'm back now with this top from House of CV. Um, I actually just realized I took a large plus and not a large, um, but that's fine. I'm probably just get it altered because it's a bit loose as you can see um, I love this top I think it's super cute as you can see super duper cute um, it's just a bit big though because can you see like there's so much cup space um, and the arms but it's fine I'll get it altered I'll take it to my tailor um, if I remember correctly this top was about 1.2 now they are pricey guys but you pay for quality first of all the quality is insane like here there's like even like corset thing to make it like you know and you see like the back is super cute this is supposed to clip but like i can't uh, yeah so <laughs> yeah it's a bit tricky but you can see it's really really cute it's like a cute nice top and i would definitely wear this like 
with a nice, I could wear it with jeans, I could wear it with a skirt, I could wear it with shorts, you know, um, daytime or nighttime, depending on how I dress it up or dress it down. Um, it's a very versatile top, I love the arms. I'm a sucker for poofy arms. Um, if you saw my birthday dress, poofy arm, also House of CB. Um, so yeah, off shoulder vibe, very nice. And I think I took a large plus because I bought a top from them um, the beginning of the year, the black one. I think you've seen my Instagram post, the, the nice one. And that one was a bit tight when I took it in a, a medium. So that's why I was meant to take a large, but yeah, whatever, it doesn't matter now. Um, but yeah, it's really cute top, 1.2. Um, yeah, I really like it. It's really my style. Like, I like, it's, I love styles that like are very like old school farm girl vibe, you know, um, countryside look. That is my look because I'm a farm girl at heart, and not just for heart, but a real farm girl. So really cute. Um, I definitely intend to wear this when I go to a wine farm. Um, so definitely would wear it to a wine farm or I definitely wear it like with a long flowy skirt or loose fitted pants you know those loose ones and just heel end it and just rock it like to a daytime function definitely um, so yeah I like it um, now I'm going to move on to the dress from House of CB which was also I love that dress a lot um, and then after that we are done so on to the last and final item okay so this is the final look I thought I should keep this for last give you guys some thigh yes come through house of CV Jesus I wanted this dress so badly when I saw it on the Instagram page and I was like I have to have it this is a large it was quite pricey I think it was like 2.3 but I had to have it. I'm sorry. I had to. I had to. Love. Now, can I tell you what I love about House of CB dresses? They don't play around when it comes to waist. And their tops, actually. They don't play. They accentuate the waist with whatever they put in there, whatever boning. As you can see, I, I feel snatched even. Um, this is a large. Senorita, I feel for you. I really feel like. Hey, Beyonce on holiday or something, child, come through! Yes, and it's got like the summer girl, you know? Summertime, summer dress. Yes! Love it! Love it! The cups are perfect, as you can see. Um, and I like the fact that you can tighten it here. You tighten this string. It goes all the way through and you just like pull it you see to tighten it and then you can make a cute little bow and voila this is like European summer dress you know yeah hi Sana this dress was exactly what I envisioned when I saw it and I saw it on the, the grill and I saw what I would look like and I just feel so I don't know what I feel like but geez yeah love this dress uh, love the color first of all love the slit I'm a sucker for a dress with the slit also and finally slit and finally slit so geez love it love how it sits how it makes my body look how it makes my booty look sorry about this this is what they come with it's like the warranty thing in case like you need to return it so you can't cut it off so I just left it on but Perfect dress, perfect date night dress, sultry. Take me now, signore. <laughs> What's it? Take me now, Jean Pierre. I am yours forevermore. <laughs> this is the dress for me, and it's very comfy on the boobies. You can move. Yeah, no, this is like the dress. And if like you want to be sexy, then you just put the arm and you're just like, you know? So anyway, uh, love this dress. Damn, I 
did save the best for last. They always say that. This is like the the showstopper on a runway show. Definitely depots. But anyway guys, I think that's enough coordinates for me. And this is the, actually yeah, I forgot to do this. You know what summer dress check is? I always do this whenever I buy like a summer dress or something. I check in the mirror that it's gonna move. Yes, 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 yeah, yes. So if it doesn't have that movement, then I don't want it because it must show, you know? But yeah, this dress is perfecto. Love it. Um, I bought this dress because I really wanted that yellow dress that everybody's got, but I can't seem to find it. Um, I think I want the original. I know that there's other versions, but I want the original, and we all know why. But no shade, but yeah. Um, so this is my version of the yellow dress. Anyway, guys, um, I, that is everything that I put on. My couch is a mess, but it was worth it because I really enjoyed doing this. I'll definitely do more whenever I buy more things. But yeah, we have come to the end of Megan's try on haul and I really hope that you guys enjoyed it I had fun um, so all you have to do now is if you haven't subscribed please do subscribe to my channel more videos will be coming um, if you love this video thumbs up would be great if you didn't it's okay you can just give a thumbs down nothing personal this is all just a learning curve for us all but anyway guys I really really hope that you enjoyed this video um, Please do follow me on my social channels, Megan Galley underscore on Instagram, Miss Galley on Twitter. I don't care for Facebook, so we ain't gonna talk about that. So yeah, thank you very much for tuning in and sticking up with my craziness throughout this video. Hope you enjoyed it and have a lovely, lovely day, night, morning, whatever it is whenever you watch this video. And sending all my love to you.